The Panda Party writes Senator Hawley and demands he take down his Rona Origins bill. However, they forgot that he is not JB. Yeah, he stood his ground. Hawley responds. He's like, no, I, I, I don't care if I'm not number one. I don't care if, I don't care if the president is in your coffers. He's not my boss, okay? And in fact, the legislative branch has checks against the president and vice versa and blah, 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 the big triangle, three, separ three, three branches of government thing, right? Anyways, political reported, U.S. House sent legislation to JB on Friday requiring the administration to declassify all information held by U.S. agencies relating to potential links between pandas, uh, lab and Rona. Every representative from both the Democrat and GOP voted for the bill. Last week, the U.S. Senate also voted unanimously for the bill. Wow, that's amazing. I didn't know about that. There must be something behind their vote, especially since we all know it will indict Dr. Elf. Wow, the Democrat darling. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm telling you guys, there's been there's a, there's a split right now between the, the Zionists and the, the Chinese Communist Party. There's a split now, okay? Before before last February, when the minor incursion happened in Ukraine, uh, they were all buddies. They're all friends. Our, our Western media co constantly covered for them. Okay, now they're not. And it's because of the, of the invasion. There's an invasion, and on top of that, Pandalan's not on our side. They're on the other side. And I'm like, all I can say is, I told you so. I told you not to trust them. No, no. Now they're shuffling. Now they have to. Now they have to go and unbrainwash people that the panda parties are good. And the NBA is not stopping. The NBA still wants some of that panda money, right? Anyways, uh, Josh Holly uh, uh, sponsored the bill. Yeah, the Rona Origins bill, guys. The panda party officials wrote Holly this week and demanded that he drop the bill. They are very worried. Dr. Elf wasn't the only one lying about Rona. Yes, and he, by the way, he went on CNN saying that, yeah, I said a natural occurrence. A leak is a natural occurrence. No, it's not. See, he's trying to twist words to not be guilty about things. He's going away, guys. He's going down hard. Okay. Senator Hawley responds to the Chai Coms on Friday. He writes, the bill will soon be law unless you can convince JB to veto it. Time is up. Come clean about your role spreading Rona to the world. Yeah. So, um, I don't know. Uh, do you, uh, 555, if you think that JB is going to veto it, 000, if you don't. I say 000 only because I see the split between the Zionists and the, and the Panda Party. Uh, I see that split. I mean, uh, they, they just passed that bill unanimously to ban TikTok. So, I mean, it passed the Senate, guys. That's a, that's a Democrat-controlled chamber, okay? And it passed. So I don't think, and by the way, JB's already signed an executive order to ban TikTok from the government devices. So for him, do, is it likely he's going to veto a bill banning it from the whole country? Maybe. I don't know. You know? But this one, Rona Origins. Oh, look at that, guys. They're mad. They're mad at the pandas. Like, hey, you're supposed to help us beat the bears, and you're not. You're on their side. Your bears just like the panda bears. You know? <coughs> The only thing protecting Panda Land right now is JB. Fortunately for the Panda Party, uh, the JB family is bought and paid for. This ought to be an interesting week ahead. Yeah, we'll see if he signs it or not. We'll see if he signs it or not. Dr. Alf, yeah, I have to call him by a code name because I can't say his name anymore because it's a naughty word on you tizzles. Yeah, anyways. Uh, six channels, links in the description. Subscribe to the ones you want. Ring the bell for notifications on this side. Six channels separated by subject matter. Thank you. Hello, guys. Uh, DT should never should over to buy DT should over to buy Signature Bank for pennies on a dollar. Um, I don't think he has the money for it. He's not that rich. He says he's got like one and a half billion. He used to have three, but he lost half of it being president. Um, but yeah, um, Signature Bank. By the way, if you don't remember, Signature Bank was the bank that debanked DT. Remember that. And by the way, the, one of the board members is, um, <clears throat> who's that? Who's his face? One of the board members was, um, it's one of those deep statey dummy crack guys. But yeah, um, DT was debanked by Signature Bank and now they went under. <laughs> yeah.